Hey, what's good? My name is Joe, owner of Sneaker Beach Street Boutique, Patchwork, New York, Long Island. Yo, my name is Jonas, Sneaker Bistro. I do marketing promotions. What's good? My name's Matt. I'm the manager of Sneaker Bistro, repping Long Island. Um, I started back in the sneaker game back in about 1989 when I was 13 years old. That's when I got hooked onto sneakers. But I actually opened up the boutique in Long Island, New York in 2006. So we're coming up to our four year anniversary this year. Let's put it this way. Our motto is serving up the freshest kicks with five star service. It's not just about the kicks, it's about the experience. When you come into our shop, you don't get that rush, rush, get that sale out the door. We get dudes who come in just to come in, kick it, talk about the culture, talk about the next release, talk about just anything. It's about the whole entire experience and that's why I wanted to open up in New York. I'm not knocking any of those stores because they all do a great job. I've been there, done that. I wanted to take the game to the next level. The game was lacking the customer service and that's what we do. Our clientele, our clientele definitely considered family. I mean, you don't have to come in and cock kicks, man. You just come and kick it with us the whole day. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to come and spend a dime. You know what I mean? You just come, kick it, we talk about kicks. And it's, it's kind of it's kind of refreshing, you know what I'm saying? Um, there's not a lot of people who are into like the sneaker game, man. So when you're at the store, it's, it's kind of like a refreshing feeling. You know what I mean? Uh, you get to talk about, you know, new releases, old releases, what's your favorite kick. You know what I mean? You get to, you get to mingle amongst your community, amongst, you know, your own. You know what I mean? Like for me, it's not like, it's not just a paycheck. You know, I live the life. I've been collecting sneakers since I'm 15, I'm 26. And to me, I love going to work. I love talking kicks, seeing what's coming out, you know, seeing what people cut rocking in the store. I, to me, it's just, it ain't a job, you know, it's, like, it's something I do. It's just, I happen to work at the store, you know? To me, right now, um, hopefully when I get back from the A right now, hopefully I receive the new 24-7, the chili red colorway, the 95 upper with the 360 bottom. stupid. I'm really, really excited about them. Um, I also heard they're re-releasing the Jones Beach Air Force Ones again this year. So I'm really Long excited Island. about that. Long Island! Um, and just stay tuned, like hopefully next year we got a bunch of collabos coming out for ourselves. Definitely, Sneaker Beach Show is definitely growing as a brand. Um, my, my, my... Look at what I'm looking forward to. I mean, it hasn't been hinted out or anything. But one of my favorite sneakers I slept on when I was in the sixth, seventh grade was the uh, Griffey Air Max One in the green colorway. I mean, not a lot of people know about that. I mean, you know what I mean? It, it, it hasn't been hinted. I mean, it ha Nike hasn't put nothing out yet, but it's been in my wallpaper on my laptop for about a year now. So I'm crossing my fingers. Me, I'm. I love pennies. I love I love when they came out with the half cent. I just I just saw the cranberries. I saw the eggplants. I know they're re-releasing the Royals. They got another cranberry foam posit one coming out. So I've been loving this year with all the pennies coming out. So you had to wear one sneaker for the rest of your life. Any Air Force One for me. I've got so many Air Force Ones. That's what got me hooked in the game. So, any, I can wear Air Force Ones all day, all day long. I would have to say infrared 90s. And that's another release that I'm waiting for in yeah, August this year. Um, I can't wait to get them. That's my favorite shoe. You're, you're fine. And that's it. That's a nice sweatshirt you got You know me, way. man, I'm the biggest Air Max One fan there is. I, about, I probably have about four Air Max One red retros. Um, if I had one pair the rest of my life, would be the the OGs. You know what I mean? Uh, give me two. I'm good. <laughs>